sneak attack! <laughs> Hello, all you kung fu warriors. Kung Fu Panda, The Dragon Knight is now streaming on Netflix. So today, I'm gonna tell you about the new series while I do a little food art. I'm making bao buns inspired by characters from the show. In this series, Po meets a ton of new friends, battles a lot of bad guys, and of course, eats a bunch of tasty snacks. Bao buns are a fluffy, sweet bread stuffed with a yummy, savory filling. The series starts as Po sets off on a food tour of China. But before he even gets a chance to eat one yummy treat, villains attack. He does his best to fight the bad guys off, but the battle destroyed the village. After Po gets blamed, he heads home to Panda Village to gobble up some comfort food made by his dad, Mr. Ping. When I'm done with these bao buns, I bet they'd cheer up Po in a heartbeat. Time to pandify this bow. I used food coloring to dye some of the dough black. A little bit of water gives the bow the stickiness I need to attach pose markings. Too cute. This Poe bow is ready to fight. Now on to my next bow, which is going to look like the other main character of this series, Wandering Blade. I'm a knight. My name is Luthera of Landreth, the Wandering Blade. I dyed this dough brown to look like our new hero. She's on a mission to track down two weasels that are trying to obtain four powerful weapons. And now thanks to Poe, they already have one. joins Wandering Blade on an adventure to track down the bad guys. And of course, Poe packs some snacks for their journey. Try this, my dad's world famous red chili crisp. Oh, oh my, oh. <coughs> ha, ha, ha. Yeah, it's pretty oh. hot. Whoa! You poisoned me. Their dynamic was my favorite part of the show, which is why I decided to recreate this scene from the beginning of their journey together. Pretty good, right? And the fun is just getting started. I'm going to whip up a few more cute bow buns while I tell you about another one of my favorite scenes from Kung Fu Panda, The Dragon Knight. In one of my favorite episodes, Poe and Wandering Blade meet a group of hedgehog monks who record all of China's history. These monks are the keepers of the scrolls, but an attack by the weasels puts both the monks and the scrolls in danger. Thankfully, Poe and Wandering Blade are able to get to their city just in time to save them. Blade, let's ride! Oh! I got you, buddy! Ow, 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 ow! <laughs> Careful, Poe, those quills are sharp. I'm making hedgehog-inspired bow by adding brown dough and pinching a bunch of little points. Just like me, the hedgehogs are big fans of Poe. So I decided to recreate the scene where they formally meet after Poe and Wandering Blade save the day. These bow are so adorable, I could just eat them up. And I just might. There's so much more to love about the new show, but it's my lunchtime. To follow along with more of Poe and Wandering Blade's adventures and to see more yummy treats, watch Kung Fu Panda the Dragon Knight on Netflix. Now it's time for a snack.